Hello everybody, it's your boy Mick Thick with another episode of Red Dead 2. This episode we're starting with following Xavier, Javier, to find this boy named John. He has got himself lost in this snowstorm and we must find him for his mother and everyone else in our group because they're all worried about him. You were there, Javier. What really happened on that boat? We had the money, it seemed fine. And suddenly they were everywhere. Bounty hunters? No, Pinkertons. It was crazy. Raining bullets. Okay, so we're trying to find out a story that well, what happened with here. these boys. They stole some money, and then something went down. Dutch killed a girl in a bad way. But it was a bad situation. That ain't like him, though. Uh-oh, my bad. Uh, where am I going? We got a follow boy. I, I was just testing it out. If you press V, it changes the Trucks angle of where the camera's at. Found this guy, and he knows a pathway that we're taking Both to get to this too. lad. Sean, we don't even know. I'm surprised we escaped at all. By the time you boys showed up from the other side of town, we were only just holding on. Bad business, all right. Damn snow's coming in hard again. We'll lose these tracks if we don't move fast. So we're tracking these tracks on the ground that we see right now. It's leading us to possibly finding John, maybe. And hopefully we can find this boy. Well, just look at that. You can see mountains from every angle. We're in no man's land right now. And if anyone can come up on us and kill us, but I doubt anybody is going to be here, though. Struggling. Yeah, a lot of fresh snow here. Uh, I don't know about this, Javier. I mean, we can't follow nothing. Uh, let's push on a little bit. Maybe we'll pick up the trail again. Hopefully we will. Almost there. Come on. Now. The horses are complaining. There's too much snow. They're knee deep already. Hey, look. And we're over looking there. for a boy. Where could he See be? That? Oh, but there's something on the ground over there. What, what could that be? Uh, two birds are eating it. Oh, it's a dead horse. That's nice. Let's see if he can hear us. Come on, up there. Yeah, I think I heard someone scream. So that might be John. We're in. This ain't good. This ain't good. We inspected the horse, and it's all bloody and dead. Oh, we're now looking for this boy, and he could be anywhere. So we gotta go slow around these corners He's and we keep on trying to find somewhere. him. I don't think we can go much further on the horses. We'll have to walk from here. I grabbed that shotgun from your horse. Oh, who knows what's up ahead? So we gotta go approach our horse again. No, do not do not leave, horsey. So hold tab. Do what am I doing? Hold tab and view your stored weapons. Okay. Press Q R E to select. Different weapon. There we go. Taking a weapon off the horse. And we got a shoddy. Nice. Oh, the horse is pooping. Why would you do that in front of the camera? We taught you. You're not supposed to do that. See, my horse don't do that. Why did you do it? Inappropriate, boy. We're just going to keep on moving on. We're heading downhill this time. Seeing if John went this way. But well, we got to find him, man. It's slippery, be careful. One wrong move and we fall off the cliff and die. We do not want that. Yeah, that we're high up here. You're telling me. Oh, we just heard someone scream, help me. So I mean someone is near. Drops down here. Watch yourself. Oh, it goes down even lower and there's like a little cave down there. It's possible that someone might careful be there. Here. Line them down here. here. And now we're going under this cave to the other side. Okay from here. And it keeps on going. Watch your step. This is real slippery. Stay close to the wall. Up this way. So we use W and space to climb up the wall. There we go. Gap 
here. Over here. That sounds closer now. Come on. Now we hear a, a, the guy's time. still screaming, and we hear a bell. That means he could be very close by. We gotta find this man. Xavier's not quitting. He really wants to find this guy. And it looks like we're going into another cave, but this is gonna be it's gonna be safe for now, but there could be guys around here, so we gotta be careful. How you doing? I'm miserable. Been a tough few days. I know. Here. Take a drink of that. Yeah, thank you for this alcohol. It really helps me in desperate times like this. No. I drank it all. <laughs> None for you, Mo. Let's keep moving then. Come on. John, where are you? John! Most! Oh, we heard we heard him respond That's back. Fine. He said, I'm here. But oh, where is here? Is it down there? No, it is not. But then there's something over, over here. here. Or is that just over some flowers there. I see? Down, Marston. He's down here. You see him? Where could he be? Ah, uh, there's the boy. He's alive, but he's hurt. That's quite a scratch you got there. Never thought I'd say this, but it's good to see you, Arthur Morgan. You don't look so good. I don't feel too good neither. I'm freezing. Don't die just yet, cowboy. Come on, compadre. I'm gonna carry you on my shoulders all the way back to camp, and you're gonna owe me one after this boy. Well, we can't go back the way we came. Let's try this way. Ain't you a sorry sack? Camp? Argue with you there. See? I told Dutch you weren't the right man for this. I'm sure you did. Oh. You alright? I think so. Come on. Hopefully this will lead us out. Oh, and there's a wolf. This is not good for us, boys. There's a pack of the wolves on my horses right there. What are, what are we gonna do? So I'm gonna put my boy John on the ground for now. I might have to kill these wolves before they do anything. Keep wolves away from Xavier and John. Okay, so they're gonna be okay, boys. Okay, one is down. Oh no, 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 do not touch me. I need to kill the okay. Reload, reload, and shoot, shoot. You're done, you're done. Okay, we got one more. We hit you once. Okay. Don't go anywhere, buddy. You're dead. Haha. <laughs> hey. So we better run back to our horse as quickly as we can. We killed the three that were chasing after us. Let's go for now. Let's get to my horse over here. And let's horse cargo. Uh, mount the horse. Press E to do that. There we go. John's on the horse, Xavier's on the horse, and we're about to head out. Come on then, let's get back to the others. Yeah, let's get back to camp telling everyone that John is safe and sound, and this mission will be complete. I don't feel too good. You'll be fine. It's just like a, a dog bite. Uh, you knew a fella? Got bit by a dog. Died an hour later. You ain't gonna die. Not yet. Yeah, not yet. You gotta keep your hopes up, knowing that you will not die today. Up there! Oh, but there's more wolves coming. Oh, did I miss? Oh, I just pushed him into the wall. That's how we work, boys. Just push the wolves. Okay, I'm speedy now. Shit, there's more on the right! We got more wolves on the left! Stay back! Okay, we got one. There we go. I missed Gamu. Uh, gotta keep the wolves off of him. There we got another one. There we go. Got one hit in. Come on, hurry up. And got you. You're done. Sit down, boys. You see any more, Arthur? No, 
don't think so. Jesus. You still with us, Marston? Just about. You're gonna be okay. We have some shelter now. Thanks for coming for me. Of course. That bullet in Blackwater, now this. You had a hell of a time. And Arthur always says, I'm lucky. You should ride in the water for a bit. Try to lose a scent. Don't want to leave a trail right back to camp. So this, what you know, Xavier is saying, if we we're ride in the water, it'll lose the scent, so the wolves will not storm. be able to chase us after. So, freezing, bleeding, starving, damn near getting eaten to death ain't good enough for you. Yeah, come on. Let's push hard and get back. See those buildings up ahead, John? That's where we camped. Nearly there. We're just about arriving back home and we are going to be safe. And everyone's going to be relieved that we got Johnny Boy John! back. Someone help John down off this horse. Can we get some help here? No one's coming out of their house to help? Come on, we need you boys. Help us. Can we get some help? We need some help here. Come on, help him down. You're alive. You're alive. Yes, John Marston is alive. Get him into the house. Make sure he's drunken, eaten, and he's will be okay. Oh, come on, let's get you warm. Thank you. Thank you both. This is a new low, even by your standards. Thank you, Arthur. Thank you. You got any other lost maidens need saving? <laughs> Not today. Have you and Dutch talked about how we're going to get out of this? I was just discussing with Herr Strauss when the weather breaks. I suppose we'll have to keep heading east. East? Into all that? That civilization? I know. The west is where our problems are worse. Come on, Herr Strauss. Let's get warm. Thank you, Mr. Morgan. Yes, Strauss. I did you a good debt. You owe me one. So we're going to my fire now to warm up. And we're going to see what we got to do next. We have been running for weeks. We found shelter and been resting here in some old abandoned mining town while we wait the thaw. Hardly the spring I had been hoping for. Okay, we got a new journal entry. Mission complete. There you go. And here is your boy right here. So it looks like we have to sit down. And let's do that. When the storm breaks, we move. Oh, not in this chair. I didn't want to sit down in this chair. Warm enough. Go to B to speak to Bill. Go to P to speak to Mr. Pearson. So let's get up. Do we have a map? Yeah, okay. So this is a, a very big part of the map right now. This is where we are. We can either go to Bill or Pearson. Let's Not go outside and talk to one of them and then go to the other and see what we got to do. What do you think, Arthur? Well, I wasn't on that boat, so hard to say. But I so heading outside and I guess we can talk to Bill here. But to talk to him, we got to head on inside, past Xavier here, and see oh, what he boys, offers. Because I thought you liked action. A couple of days on the lam. And you lot have all turned yellow. Apart from you, of course. Shut up, Micah. I ain't never seen so many long faces. Mm. I guess, I guess folks miss them. That fell. But when I fall, I don't want no fuss. When you fall, there'll be a party. <laughs> a party. <laughs> Probably. Uh -huh. Funny, huh? Sure. <laughs> Relax, but we're just joking around. I don't feel like being laughed at by the likes of you two. Stop it! Now! You fools punching each other when Como Driscoll's needing punching hard. You want to sit around waiting for him to come find us? All of you, we got work to do. Come on. Are you sure about this, Dutch? Yes. Both been through a lot recently. We hardly back on our feet yet. And the last thing we need is to get bushwhacked by Como Driscoll. Let's go. I know you hate him, Dutch. He's here for us. I doubt that. No, you're just doubting me. I would never doubt you, Dutch. You... You always said revenge is a luxury we can't afford. This is the right call, Arthur. Take this. And this is about more than revenge for business long ago. They were talking about trains and detonators. Here. Comb always had good information come on and you think now is the right time to hit a train now you might fancy living on deer piss and rabbit shit 
I'm getting too old for that life. Mr. Matthews, Mr. Smith, Mr. Pearson, would you please look after the place? There are O'Driscolls about. Yeah! You heard them, boys. We about to head out, and we expect you to make sure that this place stays safe for us arrival west, back. Right, Arthur? Yeah. He said follow the main trail southwest. They're camped near some lake. Okay. Let's go find these bastards before they find us and rob this score they're planning. That is true. So we are looking for a camp to kill all these O'Driscolls to make sure they cannot kill us, murder us, or get in our way to get back to our normal lives. We're just seeing it, um, us traveling on the horses in a cinematic effect, which is nice. So we're going to keep up with Dutch here. And as we move along, get closer, we'll see what we do. What's that? Tracks. Horses, quite a few of them. We, we found tracks on the ground. They could as far be as I can leading tell, to where we got to go. The only fools out here are us and them. They must be this way. They probably you are this way. Dish. we got to find them, Dutch. Let's keep of on course. heading out. Listen, I know you don't think much of my ideas recently, but this is the right move. Okay. You know I got your back. I learned a long time ago that you hit Como Driscoll. Wait for him, and people you love will die. This feud between you and him needs to be put to rest, one way or another. <laughs> it will be. Some things I can forgive, others I can forget. What he did to Hannibal, I can't do neither. You killed his brother, Dutch. Yes, I did. I hope the bastards will be reunited soon enough. That's how this will end. See that smoke? Let's cut up here and take a look. They said it was near the lake, so we must be close. So there's a smokestack right, right ahead of us. We're about to go investigate it, see if anyone is there, and see if we might have to take them out, kill them, or Hold talk to them. It's gonna be one of those. God damn it! Oh. You're waiting for me to go. All right, okay, thank you. This is it. Are we goddamn ready? Ready, Dutch. Yes, Good. we are, sir. Now, Mr. Morgan and I, we're gonna head up here a little, see if we can't get a sense of the layout of the camp. Mr. Williamson, Mr. Bell, you two take up a hidden position just outside the camp. Mr. Summers, Mr. Escuela, you two, Hold position here. Let's go. Okay, so we're getting off our horses now. We're gonna walk to position, and then we'll be ready to take these boys out. So we're just reaching the edge of this cliff up here. Our boys are getting in position over there, and it looks like there is a little town down there that we're about to raid. Getting our binoculars out. These horses, people. There they are. That's definitely them. Home? They destroyed buildings. I think so. Yeah, that's him. So we're just looking around with our binoculars. There's a guy there. So it looks like they're talking, they're going somewhere. And this guy's going up the ladder, we gotta be aware of him. He's gonna be up there. Who's he talking to? He don't seem very happy. No. He slaps him, what are you doing? They leaving? Seem to be. Should we go get him? No. Cone can wait. Best to get some of them out of there. And much less fun to rob him and his score if he never finds out about it. All right, let's go pay our old friends a visit. Yes, we are now getting up. Oh! We're going back down to our horses, and we're ready Don't to take these boys out because they are our horse. enemy. Weapons not set in the loadout here before dismounting will remain on your you horse. Too. Approach Get your horse and, keep us and hold tab. You got it, Dutch. 
So we want to change our weapons to the pistol. I'll take that from you, Horsey. Good job, Bessie. And we're we about to head out with the boys. The rifle's no use to us sitting on your horse, Arthur. What? Oh, you want me to take my rifle? Why didn't you just say that? Uh... Are you hearing me? You're going to need that rifle. Relax, boy, boy. Wait, I can't equip my rifle though. Let's see this. It's just the pistol and the shoddy. Wait, what if we go to items? Approach your horse, hold tab to view your stored weapons. Hold tab, okay. We got that. Oh, there we go. Good. Come on, let's go. Here we got our, our, our rifle and a pistol. We're gonna Seems stick to the rifle to for the now. Same path down it's as like Dylan a sniper. Micah. Like you said, revenge is a luxury we can't afford. Yeah, just wasn't sure you agreed with me. Arthur. Arthur, have you completely lost faith in me? Our needs right now are supplies, equipment, and a way out of here. Everything else, including calm, can wait. Okay. There's enough of those bastards down there to deal with as it is. Now come on. That is true, Dutch. We gotta kill these people. Revenge is something we cannot afford right now. Gotta take them all out, loot the bodies, get some supplies, and head back to the group. And then we'll be safe and sound. Oh, that is a long way down. Do not want to fall off that, because then if you do, you probably go bye-bye. So just gotta keep on moving, and it looks like this path that we're taking right now leads all the way down to the ground floor there, and we're just gonna keep walking that, taking it, and then gonna get ready to take these boys out, y'all. There are advantage oh, points out. up here that we can it's bit steep. take advantage that they will not know we're here. See, there's a guy right there. I could kill him right now, but that's not part of the plan. We got to get closer to the ground. And now that we're getting closer, we can hear them talking. Which is something that's kind of cool. And we're still heading on down closer, and the, we're already down to the bottom. Maybe here. We I get should ready. take the lead on this. They're going to be gunning for you. They ain't got me yet. No, but the way our luck's been running. Hush. Let's just get down there first. Don't worry, Dutch. We're down almost there. These trees, quick. And we'll do some work. We're about to have some fun. Hey, see me? We're about to kill these boys. I can really hear them yelling at each other now. Stay low. So now we're crouching to make sure they do not see us. We're close enough that they can oh, know where we are if we're standing straight up. But we gotta be nice and quiet. So there's a couple guys to the left. I don't see anyone on the right right now, okay, but there's a guy in front of us. Oh, this guy's on our side. That's good. So, what are we doing, Dutch? I can take this if you want. Just make the call. You want to take the lead? Go. Wait, send the gang. We have to take the lead. I'll take the lead. Okay. I'll go first. I'll go first. So here we go. Three, two, one. Pop. We got one down. Okay, they're shooting us. At us, we can now stop crouching. Now, but we gotta start shooting these boys. Okay, you wanna fight, Tubby? Oh, sit down. You don't get to fight. Oh, I missed. I had to reload. I'm sorry. Oh, there you go. Beauty of a mug shot there. We go. We got another one down. Just gotta keep on shooting, and we're perfectly fine. This guy is kind of bothering me. Hey, there he's down in there. For these guys, it takes one headshot or two body shots to kill them. 
Got some good information that we need to know. There we go. We've got one. Let's reload. We got another one there. He's not down yet, but we gotta keep shooting him. There, he's down now. Nice, nice, nice. We can move forward. Okay, we are hurting bad. We gotta be preparing to fight these guys. Okay, so let's just hide behind here for a second. We, we must heal ourselves. But it does take a while to heal. Just let him shoot. Oh no, back down, down, down. Okay, down. Shot. Okay, now let's reload. And he's done. There you go. And we have gone some health back. There we go. One, one shot's away. Oh, we cannot hit him from there. Okay, he is down. There we go. And I don't think we're able to loot these bodies until we deal with everybody, because it's still the beginning of the story here. There we go. He's down too. Is there anyone left? Yes, there is. Hide behind the barrels here. Okay, oh, we got this big boy up here. I shot him and he fell and falls off the tower. There you go. So it looks like there's gonna be some guys over here. Okay, I see you, bud. I see you, bro. Oh, you're down now. Okay, so where where are you, boys? Gotta kill y'all. So we have upgraded our stamina to 25%. That's nice. But I don't see anybody. What are, are y'all shooting at? Okay, he's over here. Oh, okay. There we go. Headshot to the beauty. Nice. Oh, damn it. They're still hiding in those cabins. Search the bodies. Strip everything we can from them. So we got to search these bodies as well as we can. Let's loot this one. What do we get? Of course not. 89 cents, that a boy. I need all the money I can get. Oh, four chewing tobacco. I think that's gold. It was in a gold color. Those things are probably rare. So we search this building, and there's gonna be another dead body in this one we can check out. Oh, he's an ugly fellow. Look at him. We got four repeater cartridges and more chewing tobacco, which is always good. Probably sell that for some money too. Keep nice. The bodies, Arthur. Don't worry, I'm searching all the bodies. Mr. Oh, these are all oh, Driscoll boys, and more boys are coming in. Oh, they're in the forest. I don't want to fight them right now because I want to loot the bodies because I can get some real money off these boys. Let's just keep looting while my other boys take a worry about the guys in the forest. Take out O'Driscoll's, that's what we're doing right now. But right now, I'm just looting, we got Miracle Taunt, nice. Okay, we can't equip our weapon right now, because I would have to equip it myself. Right now, I just want to loot the body, please. So we got, okay, it looks like there's going to be two more bodies in the barn here. We got one there. And then we have another one here. We just keep getting more repeater things and platinum, even great something. Sounds nice. What's happening? Oh, did one of my boys die? No. How could we let this happen? Okay, restart, checkpoint. I wonder where that's gonna put us. Heads up, boys! We got more coming in from the forest! Yeah, so now we should take out the guys from the forest, and then we'll loot the bodies. That's what, that's what we should have done from the beginning. Oh, there's lots of them too. I misjudged them. I thought there was going to be like four or five, but there's a lot more. Oh, wow. Aiming. Press the middle button to do Deadeye. And shoot. Oh, that's so much more effective, boys. Oh, and it does, this dead eye does work really well, but you can run out of it eventually. Okay, where are they? Show yourself, boys. Like, are you saying that we have to run to them? Oh, there's so much. Okay, shot, 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 shot. Get that. Oh, wait. Oh. 
Okay, we got you. We got you. There you go. Arthur Morgan is putting in that work. There we go. Okay, more boys to deal with. Here we shot one, but there's still another one here. Oh, there's so many. Fall back, please, boys. So we got one. You're dead. And let's shoot them. And you're done, too. There we go. Let's reload, please. And we are now out of dead eye, so let's back off for a second. We are low on health, so we gotta be careful here. There we go, we got another one is down. Oh, you go, one shot to the hip and you're down, boy. Sit. Please. Oh, well, while we're here, we can search this chest. Let's just take whatever's inside, please. Some health care, oh, that, those come in handy really fast. And now we're using my pistol because we're out of regular ammo for my other gun. Oh, and he just fell down like nothing. Yeah, so now the plan is to go back to the camp. We killed all the all these guys. We're going to loot them. But that, that's it for this episode, guys. Hope you all enjoyed. My name is Mick Thick, and I'll see you in the next episode of Red Dead 2. Bye-bye.